Good, everybody you know who it is, man. Look at the beard. It's coming in, man. You already know. But, um, so again, man, if you see me looking down right here, it's because I got some notes. And, um, you know, we're going to get right into it. So, why I decided to go full monk mode, right? And in this whole manosphere and this whole thing, there's a lot of different opinions and um, but I'm just going to tell you what I, what I did, what worked for me, right? Um, full monk mode, man. First, I'm, I'm going to get into what, what that means to me, right? A lot of people are, are under this notion that when you do monk mode, you got to cut off everybody. You got to cut off all your friends. You got to cut off all the girls. You got to cut off all your family. You got to lock yourself up in a room and you can't talk to nobody and you just got to work 24-7, 365 every single minute of the day, right? But that's straight up crazy, straight up craziness, right? Because we're all social creatures, right? We can't just lock ourselves up in a room for, you know, even the whole day. I don't know about you guys, but I can't be in, I can't be in the room a whole day without leaving man for something you know what i'm saying i gotta i gotta do something but um you know with that being said what monk mode means to me and why i decided to go full monk mode is because i just turned 26 this year right i was in the military for four years right and coming out of there I'm I'm grateful, right, to say that I'm in a I'm in a better spot than than most 25 year olds or 26 year old now, and um, you know I'm thankful for it, man. But I'm thankful, but I'm not satisfied. I need more. You know what I'm saying? I need more. I like I like I like dressing nice. I like looking good. I like having nice things. I like the car that I drive. I like the place that I live. I want a better place, right? Um, I ha I like the laptop that I have, but I, you know what I'm saying? Like these things right here, man, they're all material things, right? They don't, they, they shouldn't define you, right? Because at a certain point, and let me get into this real quick, man. At a certain point, it's not about the things that you have, right? It's about the person that you became to, to, to get these things, right? Everybody could go, a, a, any anybody with a million dollars or, or anybody just wealthy and rich could go up to a dealership and get any car that they want. It, any, any rich person could do that. It doesn't take a mentality to just go and say, hey, I like this car, I'm gonna go get it. It doesn't take a special person to do that. It takes money, I'll tell you that. It does take money, but it doesn't take a mentality it doesn't take a learned mentality to go out there and, 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 and get that right what I want can't be bought you see what I'm saying what I what I want can't be sold in stores you can't ship that to me I gotta go out and I gotta learn and I and I gotta go and, and, and learn how to do it and get it right Right and, and and everything that that's how I've been with everything. I to this point in my life, all the stuff that I learned, I'm teaching you guys. Right, teaching you guys, and I'm and I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna teach. I have way more to teach you. And again, I just turned 26. Right, I have I have some experience under under my belt, man. That that uh, a lot of you young guys could definitely benefit from. You know what I'm saying? But anyway. Let me get into the topic, right? So, why I went full monk mode is because I've done the partying. I did that when I was in high school. I went to an all white school, man. I'm 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 Hispanic, right? But I'm saying I went to an all white school, and we already know that rich rich white people the 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 stereotypical rich white people they could party we all know that so here i go 16 17 18 years old 
go to these crazy mansion parties, right? And 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 talking to girls and alcohol and all that stuff was involved. So what I'm saying is I've been through that, right? So okay, cool. Check one 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 off the off, off the list, right? Off of the things that you think you're missing out on. Check one of them off. Number two, women, right? I had a girlfriend since I was 14 years old. I st my first girlfriend was at 14 years old. I lost my virginity when I was 15 years old, man. Right? So I've been, I've been, I never had an issue with women. I've always had some type of woman, some type of female validation in my life, always, right? So I'm not missing out on that. There's, man, there's women all around us. I said in one of my last videos, I could go to the damn grocery store right now, meet a girl, get a number, take her out tonight, maybe. That's how confident I am. But guess what? I've been through it. And when you have a goal in your mind and, and you, you, you've been through enough things, you can weed out what's not going to help you get to that goal. You see what I'm saying? I see my goal so clearly. I know I could put girls on the back burner for a little bit. I know I could put alcohol partying and friends on the back burner for a little bit. I'm not saying I don't go out um, every every other weekend and, and 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 have a good time and have 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 a drink, have some dinner, uh, you know, with a nice young lady. But all I'm saying is, it's like what I said in my last video. If you eat junk food every single day, two, two uh, once a day or twice twice uh, twice a day. What's gonna happen? Eventually, you're gonna get fat, man. Eventually, you're gonna see something. Might not just be now, but you're gonna, you might uh, get diabetes, right? It's the same thing with this. I know that women are a distraction. I know that alcohol is not gonna help me get to my goals. If anything, it's gonna hold me back, right? In moderation, again, a lot of people think in extremes. I don't because life isn't a black or white type of thing. You see what I'm saying? There's, there's, there's different things. You can, if you know what you're doing, I'll say this. If you're my age and you've had um, some experience, right? You've had some jobs. You've had... Uh, you had some girlfriends. You've had you had some win. You you you've taken your L's, but you also have your your W's. You know what I'm saying? You've got your wins. You've got your losses, and you've been through some stuff. But we're still young. I would say you know how to how to handle certain things. But if you're 16, if you're 14, 15, 16, 17, those years are when your brain is the most vulnerable. I know it, man. I've been there, and it's and it and it's worse now because y'all got the internet. Y'all got way too much distractions y'all got porn y'all got social media y'all got women you got uh gaming you got you know xbox ps4 oh the ps5 is about to drop the xbox x series is about to drop you got all these things and then you got your friends that that, that are calling you constantly hey bro did you see this did you see this uh um you know did uh you know you are you gonna cop the new xbox bro let's let's hop on live oh hold on bro i gotta go hey you want to come to my birthday party you got so much shit going on man and it's and, and 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 i know what it feels like to be 15 16 years old where you feel like you gotta be a part of everything because you feel like you're missing out but guess what those years you're never gonna get them back 14 15 16 17 you're never gonna get them back if you start now, I'm not saying cut everything completely out, but if you start now and you get serious about a goal and no matter what, you keep that goal top top tier, top focus, right? And at least go at it 1% every single day, even if it's 30 minutes, even if it's one hour. If you work towards it every single day for one hour, 30 minutes at the most, whatever, man, just find time for that one thing if you want to make music, at least go on YouTube. Find out how uh, how to make a uh, how to make a song on YouTube. What software do I need? What what microphone do I need? All you need is a laptop, bro. Look, this is all I got. It's a MacBook Pro. That's all I have on my desk right there. MacBook Pro and a microphone. 
It's all you need. How to start a YouTube channel, how to start a business. All of these things are online. But what I'm saying is that when I say monk mode, you gotta you gotta dedicate yourself to the number to that one thing and not let anybody or anything distract you. Because I tell you what, man, you're 15, 60 right now, you're gonna wake up one day, and I know, oh, here we go, it's, it's that cliche thing, but it's true. You're gonna wake up one day, 23 years old, and be like, damn, bro. On, you're gonna wake up on your way to a, on your way to a, to a job, right? Like retail or something like that. And, 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 and it's gonna be one of those days where you're like, man, I wish I didn't have to work today. And then you're gonna look back and think, damn, man, like, what was I doing at 16? Like, man, if only I started at 16, I, I could have had a business by now. Dedicate yourself to something, man. Because if, cause, cause even if you don't know what it is right now, right off the bat, try it. If your interest is this much in it, just try it. Try it. That's what I wish I would have done whenever I was like 14, 50, 60. I wish I, wish I would have had the advice that, that I'm giving you guys right now. I wish I would have had it when I was 14, 15, 16. I would have started making beats and making music when I was at that age. I would have got a laptop, got a microphone, and started making music. Because guess what? I taught myself how to do all that shit in, 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 in a year, less than a year. I made about 100 songs on my own, man. On my own. But what I'm saying is that when you're young, you, you look, being ambitious doesn't cost you nothing when you're young. You can do whatever. You can, I'm going to go paint. I'm going to go do this. I'm going to go do that. I'm going to do this. Do all that, bro. Do it all until you figure one thing out where you're like, man, I, I love this thing. In the lows and the highs. Not everything is, 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 is happiness and success and all that stuff. You gotta go through the lows too, man. I gotta, I gotta smoothies business. I gotta shakes business. It sucks whenever I gotta pay taxes. It sucks whenever people don't like the products. It sucks when somebody has to come and, 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 and uh, complain because something wasn't right. That sucks, man. But I love it because it's my passion. I used to be a, a personal trainer, so I love helping people, right? But for me, it, was, it wasn't it was just helping people change their physical. You got to start internal as well. And what's that? What you put into your mind, what you put into your body. That was my passion, man. And that's still my passion, especially with these videos. I'm feeding your brain right now. I'm feeding your mind with good, good uh, thoughts, good content to make, wake you up, to get you out of this routine that we've all been conditioned to, right? It might not be the same one, but it's it's your own version of a routine that is just constant, constant until you die, bro. Straight up, that's usually how people go through life. Go to work, they come home, they eat, watch TV, go to sleep, repeat, 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 die. It's a sad life, man. That's what I'm saying. Folk, find one thing, right? And if, it's, if you can't find that one thing, try it all. Make a top 10 list and, and, and this week I'm gonna try this, this week I'm gonna try this, this week I'm gonna try this until I find something I like. That's it, man. That's today's video, man. I hope y'all enjoy it and I'll see you.